Now to a CBS 4 News safety alert and take a good look at this man. Police are desperately searching for him. He could be armed and dangerous. Officers blame him for the theft of two assault rifles, and he took them from a car inside a Brickle parking garage. CBS 4's Araya Ortega reports from Brickle. Take a close look at the man seen here. City of Miami police need to find him after they say he got his hands on two assault rifles. Investigators say surveillance cameras captured him taking those weapons from the trunk of a car parked inside the parking garage of this high rise building on Brickle on Sunday. We see a man starts going around opening car doors. The man gets inside an unlocked black Mercedes Benz parked on the seventh floor of the parking garage at 1050 Brickle Avenue. He made his way inside the car, started ransacking the car, took about four minutes inside, and then he popped the trunk. But when he opened that trunk, he found that there were two assault rifles. The man puts the weapons in a bag and takes off. Residents are now uneasy, wondering how the man managed to get inside a building they considered to be secure. It's very hard to get into our building. Our doormen are great. We have great security team. And everything you have to have a security fob in order to get into the garage. You have to scan it in order to get into the building. You have to scan your fob. This happened Sunday night. So I'm really upset that it's now Wednesday and I'm just learning about this story. The man is described as a slim built a man about six feet tall, last seen wearing an orange shirt, dark hat, and carrying a blue Adidas book bag. Having those two assault rifles on the street and falling into the wrong hands is a big mistake. We need to know who this man is, where those guns are, and definitely his whereabouts. Oralia Ortega, CBS 4 News Tonight. We asked the police as well as an attorney if the gun owner would be in any trouble for leaving a high-powered assault rifle in an unlocked car. Apparently, because they were in the trunk, Florida law considers them to have been properly secured.